Yes. Oh, uh, I'm looking for Bert Hansen. I'm Mrs. Hansen. Can I help you? Oh, it's very important I see Bert. Is he in? Bert? No, he just left. Won't you come in? Oh, thank you. I'm Virginia Hansen. Did Bert tell you we were married once? Oh, I see he didn't. Honestly, I'm sorry. He should have told you. That's just like him. Did you say you were married to my husband? Up until about a month ago. That's when I got my final decree. But Bert doesn't know anything about that. You look sick. Won't you sit down, Mrs. Hanson? I'm a little confused. I know how you feel. I was married to him, too. You must be mistaken. After all, the name Bert Hansen isn't a very unusual one. Bert couldn't have changed too much. The younger man in the picture is my husband. The other man is Bert's father. Did he tell you anything about him? Only that he died several years ago. I can see he's very much alive. As a matter of fact, I bumped into him the other day. He's here in Los Angeles on a vacation. At the uh, Chapman Park Hotel, I think. Were you, uh, were you married in Racine? Why Racine? We're from Chicago. That's where we were married. Please bear with me. I... How long were you married? Four years. We'd known each other for a long time before that. We went to school together. Everybody kind of figured we were natural, especially Bert's father. Yet you divorced him. Well, what would you do? One day he just walked out. No goodbye, no, no nothing. Quit me, quit his job. We were frantic. And then in the meantime, we heard about some trouble he'd gotten into before he enlisted. Shoplifting. Just little things. They came and took back some little presents he'd given me. We thought divorce was the only thing. You, you keep saying we. Oh, Bert's father. He was really going crazy. He made good to the stores. He's a wonderful man. Bert's father, I mean. He's very kind and considerate. Obviously, you came here for a reason. Well, yes. I'd, I'd like Bert to sign some papers. His father gave us a small piece of income property as a wedding gift, and I'd like Bert to sign a property settlement. I'm sure he won't mind. The envelope is addressed to me, and I I'm staying here with some friends. If when he signs it, you'll just mail it to me. I'll see that he gets them. I hope there won't be any trouble. There won't be. Thank you again. I appreciate it very much. I'm sorry. Well, how did you find out about Bert and me? Uh, we... We had one of those agencies, you know. They traced him to the army and later to Tijuana and then to you. That's when we got the newspaper clipping. You just can't believe a word he says. That's what the police said once when they picked him up. He just lies. Well, thanks again. I, I know how you must feel. 